Introducing Metricstream M70 IT compliance application for high performing organizations with a user experience that is engaging, efficient, and personalized, helping you simplify and strengthen your cybersecurity management program. The Metricstream IT compliance management app provides a centralized system to manage and track compliance with a range of IT regulations and standards. Through the app, senior IT management gets the visibility they need into the overall compliance posture with a comprehensive and easy-to-use dashboard showing such items as the current number of open issues, pending tasks, etc., which in turn enables senior management to better manage the compliance process and align to the overall IT governance workflow of the organization. The Metricstream IT Compliance app enables users to create a centralized repository of all regulatory standards and areas of compliance it needs to adhere to along with the related sets of controls, requirements, standards, questions, and procedures in a harmonized manner. Leveraging our partnership with Unified Compliance Framework, or UCF, you can stream the content for your pertinent regulatory standards and related controls into the application and link it to your set of internal risks, processes, and assets as seen here. This content is automatically populated into the GRC libraries and linkages are also established automatically. Additional relationships can be created manually by the users with the applicable processes, assets, and risks. Metricstream Compliance application allows compliance control assessments to be performed using surveys and compliance control tests. Let's look at how a compliance control assessment can be performed. Setting up and triggering control tests is simple. Once the compliance control test assessment is created by adding an area of compliance and the related controls, it's assigned to a user and scheduled as a task. The user can then view the task in his task inbox to open it and then select each of the controls to specify the overall result rating and design effectiveness rating, as well as provide responses to the underlying questions and details about the sample evidences. So here we're looking at two controls that need to be evaluated as part of the ISO 27001 area of compliance. Here are the questions or test procedures that need to be performed for this control. There's just one question here. So the tester can go ahead and document if the action or question was or the task was performed, provide a response, enter some comments, and also attach some evidence here. If there's any sample documentation that needs to be captured, it can be done in the sample area here. And if there's any compensating controls uh, that need to be added at the time of testing, or any issues, findings, or control failures can be captured here. Once this is all complete, the control test form can be submitted for approval. Any issues that are captured during control tests uh, to document control failures, findings or issues, or any other action that needs to be taken can be managed from a global issue management dashboard like you see here. So you can quickly see open issues broken down by priority. You can see the status of actions that are part of issues to help in remediation. You can see issues broken down by different areas of compliance or regulations, issues broken down by organization or line of business, and also issues according to uh, how old they are and what stage those issues are in. This makes it simple to keep abreast of where issues are in the resolution pipeline. All these charts, reports, dashboards are interactive as well. Metricstream IT Compliance Solution allows users to trigger and schedule surveys to assess compliance as well. This is an example of a survey created inside the application. You will notice it's very easy to use and like our applications in general, is mobile responsive. Surveys are fully customizable. Questions can be added from the question library, or they can be just added ad hoc by just typing in the questions. Questions can have a variety of response types, including lists of values, radio buttons, checkboxes, etc. Questions can also have scores attached to them and conditional logic. Surveys can be scheduled to run periodically or ad hoc, and the responses are automatically tabulated 
into reports. Here's an example of a survey response report. You can easily browse by section, by question, and by response, seeing who responded and how the responses were calculated. This information can also be downloaded and exported for further analysis. Let's wrap up with some of the key reports available in the IT compliance application. You'll be able to quickly see critical assets that have been planned or not planned to be tested, open IT compliance issues broken down by critical, high, and medium, compliance status by regulation across your assets that are marked as critical, compliance status broken down by asset class, as well as compliance scorecards by assets, asset classes, organizations, and regulations. You'll also be able to see operating controls that are missing from test or self-assessment plans or operating controls that are not mapped to reference controls.